The local 5 News, home of WeAreIowa.com. I'm Jack Miller. Thanks for joining us tonight at 6. Tonight's big story, day two of the hearing for Christian Bahena Rivera. Today was day two of a hearing that will have a major impact in the February murder trial for Bahena Rivera. Lawyers for Bahena Rivera, the man accused of stabbing Molly Tibbetts to death last year, want his confession thrown out. They say law enforcement didn't correctly conduct the questioning and it shouldn't be used in the February murder trial. Molly Tibbetts was found dead in a cornfield last year after Bahena Rivera directed law enforcement right to her body. Local 5's Eva Anderson was in the courthouse in Montezuma all day and has the latest. Around 2 p.m. Thursday here at the Powashi County Courthouse, the court wrapped up two days of dissecting 11 hours of interview. The conversation between law enforcement and Christian Bahena Rivera the day he showed them to the body of Molly Tibbetts. The judge hearing the testimony of four defense witnesses, not including Christian Bahena Rivera. BB has been offered by the defense and BB will not be accepted into evidence. Judge Joel Yates chose not to consider Bahena Rivera's written testimony since the defense wouldn't allow the state to cross-examine him. We will not submit, uh, allow our client to be cross-examined. Though Bahana Rivera's own testimony wasn't included, extended family members spoke about him as a person, describing him as quiet and shy in public, but in private, even entertaining. Uh, but in the family, he was very funny. Expert defense witnesses testified that transcripts and visuals from Bahana Rivera's interview showed unfair interrogation tactics and sleep deprivation. The prosecution hoping the judge will consider Bahena Rivera's actions at the time, no matter how much sleep he had lost before the interview. He took officers from Yerby Farms to Molly Tibbetts body. Okay. All right. So the question is, if he is able to do that, he would have done it in a sleep deprived state, correct? Correct. Judge Joel Yates now has to make a decision on how much, if any, of the evidence to be thrown out. He'll make a ruling on that. He hasn't given an exact time frame, but he says he'll do it as quickly as possible. In Montezuma at the Powashik County Courthouse, Eva Anderson, Local 5 News, We Are Iowa. And Local 5 News was streaming Christian Bahena Rivera's hearing online this morning at WeAreIowa.com. Visit the WeAreIowa.com website for the most complete coverage of the Molly Tibbetts case.